Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x plus y is equal to 5. xy is equal to 5. To find the values of x and y's from these two systems of equations. Now, in the first step, we we'll start by letting this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. Then, from equation 1, which is this x plus y is equal to 5, we'll take this x into the right side. So, it will be y is equal to 5. This x will take to this side to be minus x. Then, from equation 2, which is this x, y is equal to 5, we substitute the value of y, which is this 5 minus x. So, it will be x, then times y, which is this, it will be bracket 5 minus x, bracket is equal to this 5. Then, into here, we'll take this 5 times x times 5 is 5x. x times negative x is negative x square is equal to this 5. Then we'll take this 5 into the left side. So we we'll start by this, it will be negative x square, then plus 5x. We'll take 5 to the left side to be minus 5 is equal to 0. Then from here, negative x square will make this positive. So we'll divide the whole equation by negative 1. So, negative x squared divided by negative 1 is positive x squared. Then, positive 5x divided by negative 1 is minus 5x. Minus 5 divided by negative 1 is positive 5 is equal to 0 divided by negative 1 is 0. Then, from this quadratic equation, we'll solve this quadratic equation by using quadratic formula. Now, to find the value of x by quadratic formula, it will be equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b, it is this negative 5 bracket plus or minus square root of b square, b square b it is this negative 5 so it will be negative 5 bracket square then minus 4 times a it is 1 then times c is this 5 then over 2 times a is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative or negative to be positive 5 plus or minus square root of negative 5 square is 25 Negative 4 times 5 is negative 20. Then over this time this is 2. Then it will be x is equal to 5 plus or minus square root of 25 minus 20 is 5. Then over this 2. Then into here we have two solutions because of plus or minus. Now for the first value of x is equal to 5 then plus square root of 5 over 2. And the second value of x is equal to 5, 5 minus square root of 5, then over this 2. Now, to find the values of y, from this y is equal to 5 minus x. So, into here, from y is equal to 5 minus x then the value of y1 this is x1 y1 it will be equal to 5 minus x x is this for x1 so it will be bracket 5 plus square root of 5 bracket over 2 then it will be y1 is equal to from here this it has denominator of 2 and for this to have denominator of 2 5 is same as 10 over 2 then minus this which is 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 then bracket then from here it will be y1 is equal to the lcm of 2 and 2 it, is, it will be over over this 2 so 2 divided by 2 is 1 1 times 10 is 10 then minus 
2 divided by this 2 is 1. 1 times this inside the bracket, which is, so we'll take this negative inside the bracket to be minus 5 minus square root of 5. So it will be minus 5 minus square root of 5. Then it will be y1 is equal to this minus this is 5 minus square root of 5 over 2. So this is the value of y1. So we already get for x1 is this, for y1 is this. We can write the conclusion here. x1, comma, y1 is equal to x1 is this 5 plus square root of 5 over 2. So here, 5 plus square root of 5 over 2, comma, y1 is 5 minus square root of 5 over 2. So here, 5 minus square root of 5 over 2, bracket. So this is the first solution. Now, to find the second solution, from here, y, y is equal to 5 minus x from this x2. So it will be y2 is equal to 5 minus x2 this so it will be bracket 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 bracket then it will be y2 is equal to 5 5 to 12 denominator of 2 5 is same as 10 over 2 then minus bracket 5 minus square root of 5 bracket over 2 then from here it will be right here y2 is equal to the LCM of 2 and 2 is 2 so it will be over this 2 so 2 divided by 2 is 1 1 times 10 is 10 so it will be 10 then 2 divided by 2 is 1 1 times this negative to be negative take here inside so to be negative 5 negative and negative to be positive so to be negative 5 plus square root of 5 so here to be minus 5 plus square root of 5 then it will be y2 is equal to this minus this is 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 therefore this is the value of x2 this is the value of y2 so from x2 is 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 y2 is 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 so into here it will be x2 comma y2 so it will be equal to x2 it is 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 comma y2 is 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 bracket so these are the solutions we have two solutions into this our problem into the first solution when y the value of y it is same as the value of x into the second solution the value of x into the first solution is the same as the value of y into the second solution now let's check if these answers are correct we'll check by using this first solution here so from here x is 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 y is 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 now to check from x comma y for the first solution is equal to 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 comma 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 bracket now we substitute these values here for the first solution into these two equations now for this first equation here which is x plus y is equal to 5 we check this here now x it is this so it will be 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 then plus y it is this 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 is it equal to this 5 now the lcm here it is 2 so 2 divided by 2 it is 1 1 times this it will be 5 plus square root of 5 then 2 divided by 2 is 1 1 times this it will be plus 5 minus square root of 5 then is equal to this 5 then into here, this square root of 5 minus square root of 5 will cancel. So 5 plus 5 is 10. 10 divided by 2, it is 5, which is equal to 5. 
now it is true that left side and right side are equal then it is true for this value of, value of x and y for the first solution now to check for the multiplication of this x times y is equal to 5 from x x is this so to be x is 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 so here 5 plus square root of 5 over 2 then times y is 5 minus square root of 5 over 2 bracket is is equal to 5 is it equal to 5 now take the denominator 2 times 2 is 4 then over from this 5 plus square root of 5 times 5 minus square root of 5 this numerator's multiplication of the numerator is in the form of a perfect square so here to be 5 5 square then minus square root of 5 bracket square is it equal to this 5 then from this square root of 5 will cancel with this square so it will be 5 square is 25 then minus this 5 over 4 is it equal to this 5 now 25 minus 5 is 20 20 divided by 4 is 5 is equal to 5 now left side and right side are equal then it is true for these values of x comma y for the first solution note that also this second solution is correct thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye